Cam Newton. Ooh, it's been rough as of late for Newton. All right, it started with COVID-19. He was out for that game against the Kansas City Chiefs. And then he comes back, and in the last two games, has not been looking that impressive. Zero passing touchdowns, five interceptions. So that brings us total for the whole entire season. If you want to look at passing stats, uh, two touchdowns, seven interceptions, 969 yards, 71.7 quarterback rating. Rushing-wise, five rushing touchdowns, which is impressive. But four of those came in within the first two weeks. But he is averaging less than 200 yards passing a game. This is through five games. He's only thrown two passing touchdowns in five games. Seven interceptions, so that's more than one interceptions a game. Can Cam Newton turn around and just do wonders for the Patriots and help them lead uh, Bill Belichick and this Patriots team to a, 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 another playoff spot, a consecutive playoff spot, because they haven't missed the playoffs in a very long time. 2008 was the very last time that the Patriots missed the playoffs. And in that time, Tom Brady was not the quarterback. It was Matt Castle. So another Patriots-led team, uh, a quarterback outside of Tom Brady that leads the Patriots, could yet again miss the postseason. We have to really break it down. Cam Newton has not been looking good. And he was benched in favor of Jarrett Stidham. Now, Bill, Bill Belichick has come out and said, listen, Absolutely, Cam Newton is going to remain the starter, which I believe is the right choice. That's what you sh- you should do. Give him at least at least one or two more weeks just to see how he's going. One or two more weeks, and then you can decide to move on if you really wanted to. But Bill, Ch- Bill Belichick has a lot of faith in Cam Newton. And I do too, to be honest with you guys. I believe something is going to click, and I believe that this team is going to turn it around. A light bulb is going to go go off, and Bill Belichick it has a knack for this. He does this all the time. He does so well with helping uh, his teams that look defeated and not look that good turn it around and to do amazing things. We want to talk about 2014. We all remember that game against the Kansas City Chiefs. In 2014, the Patriots went in into that game, came out 2-2, two and two, got defeated. I believe the score was 34-7 or maybe 41-7 was the final score. The Chiefs absolutely destroyed them. And... Post-game press conferences, all the media. You got Max Kellerman talking about Tom Brady's falling off a cliff. You got uh, media asking, is Bill Belichick going to bench Tom Brady in favor of Jimmy Garoppolo? Bill Belichick ended up turning that season around, making the Super Bowl, and beating the Seattle Seahawks in the Super Bowl. So he he has a knack for this. But at that point, the Patriots were 2-2. Two and two. They're 2-4 and four right now, and it's not looking that good, especially with the emergence of Buffalo Bills and Josh Allen really turning things around and having a hold on that AFC East division. It's going to be hard for them to top that. It really is. So your best bet at this point is to make a wild card spot. And man, oh man, that seventh wild card spot that got introduced for the 2020 season is going to be more helpful than ever. More than you may think. Because the Patriots... At this point, in my eyes, I believe that's the best shot that they have is making a wild card spot. You're not going to top the Buffalo Bills by the way that they've been playing. You're just not. So the Patriots are going to have to turn it around, are going to have to get above 500 and make that wild card spot. If you watch the ads and drops videos that I came out with earlier this week, every Tuesday on this channel, you saw that I mentioned that the Buffalo Bills defense is a defense that you may want to drop. Yeah, you could stream them against the Patriots this week. I mean, if you look at the numbers, the the Patriots are giving up the third most points to opposing defenses. Yeah, understandable. I understand if you want to go ahead and and drop the or or stream the the Bills defense, but I'm telling you to drop them. I'm telling you, I'm not going to take that chance. I'm really not because you really don't know which side of Cam Newton is going to come out this Sunday against the Buffalo Bills. Sean McDermott, the, the Bills head coach has says has said that he's aware of what Cam Newton is capable of. So he's not going to take him lightly. He really isn't. And you guys shouldn't either. He's not that washed. He's still a very talented, good quarterback. Like he proved in week one against Miami. Like he proved in week two going toe-to-toe, go, going toe-to-toe with Russell Wilson. Still a very good quarterback. And I believe that this Patriots team is going to turn it around. But I definitely want to interact with the guys. And I definitely want to hear your guys' opinions. Do you believe that the Patriots are going to turn this season around and are going to, uh, Bill Belichick is just going to do his Bill Belichick thing where he just turns it around and he just ends up winning after game after game and makes the postseason and 
does well for, for the New England Patriots. So interact with us, leave your comments, and your thoughts.